we're gonna make some bao today. Start with 300 grams of all-purpose flour, 60 grams of wheat starch, but you can substitute that for cornstarch if you don't have, four grams or one and a quarter teaspoons of instant yeast, four tablespoons of sugar, half teaspoon of salt, one tablespoon of cooking oil, I don't know if it matters which oil you use, 150 milliliters of cold milk, which is kind of close to two thirds cup of milk, and you'll probably need more. Now you can mix it. The recipe says to slowly add more milk if you need it, and we're gonna need it, so. I think I need more milk. My hands are dirty. How do people do this alone? This is another like 30 milliliters of milk. Did I put too much milk in? What do I do if I put too much milk in? Here I am adding some more flour. I don't know how much I'm adding, but you know, let's hope it's gonna be enough. If not, I'll just add more milk until I have too much dough. Ooh. Cause now I'm paranoid that I made it too dry. Oh no, it's feeling okay. Okay, phew. Anyway, I'm supposed to um, knead this for like 15 minutes and then let it rest for another 15 minutes to let the yeast rest, I think, to make it easier to knead. Uh, if I was fancy and had a stand-up mixer, this would take no time at all. But we are not those people. When your dough looks cute and smooth like this, you can let it rest for 15 minutes. Be back in 15. Rested. So now we have to cut it into 12 sections and then knead each section to remove the little air pockets that might be in there and then we'll form our bows. Okay, so while you wait, put all the rest of them in the bowl and cover it again. Model those hands. Mm-hmm. Take one out. Knead it. What's need? What do you mean, what's need? What does it do? What am I doing? You're getting the air pockets out. So I just fold it? Yeah. Squeeze? Heel, huh? Push. Fold, push. push. Fold, push. So how do I know when it's done? When it's nice and smooth. I ain't, I'm not doing this right. Not with that attitude. Am I rolling you like a ball? No! A... Push. Okay. Push. And then feel this. It'll be sticky like that, smoother like that. Huh? See, you're getting there. Just needs time mm. and patience. I got no patience. Yeah. You don't want the seams in it. So you keep. Look, you go like that, press it, make it into its ball, and then you can form it like that, you know? Keep trying. Once it's in a nice little cute ball, then you put it on a little piece of parchment paper and set it aside and cover it. Look how cute! Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look yeah, at yeah. that! Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on! I guess I'll do the rest. Yes, 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 yes. Add train, take two. Mm, that's the best I get. I Try a little harder. I'll let you finish. Try a little harder. We're experimenting with a, a folded bow shape just to see what happens here. You do the same thing as the regular bow, but then you flatten it out and then fold it in half, but you keep the middle a little thicker than the edges. When it's like palm sized, you just That's a cute little, little thing. Now we're done forming them, so we have to put a little dabble of milk on top and then let them proof until they get like 50% bigger, which might be an hour, which might not be an hour. You just gotta eyeball it. Okay, so if it's good proofed, it's supposed to spring back fast, or no, slow. It's supposed to spring back slow. Wait for that steamer to boil up, and then you can put the bows in the steamer. Put your lid in a towel so it catches the, the steam drips so it doesn't hit your bows. And then you leave it like a quarter inch off the edge. And then you steam it for 15 minutes. Okay, now that that's done, you're supposed to leave the lid on for like another minute. And then we can look at them. Ooh, so smooth! Ooh. 
Look how cute! We're gonna put some uh, chasu and hoisin sauce in these sandwichy ones. In these these ones. Bow, chasu, scallion. Then a little dabble of hoisin sauce on top. They're cute. Look. Uh, I should open cute. a restaurant. Well, the actual video was about these bows. Is yep. my hair okay? Hold on, I have to turn this up. Forget now. about your hair. <laughs> really big my head. <laughs> One, two, three, go. <gasps> oh, that's good. The whole thing sauce makes it. Mm. Yeah. Mm. That's how you make a plain bow or a fun bow. <laughs> what are these called? Just now? 